We're at the Daytona Beach campus of Embry-Riddle Aeronautical University. We are physically right now at the Aircraft Accident Forensics Lab. I am Anthony Brickhouse, an Associate Professor of Aerospace and Occupational Safety. This laboratory is a wonderful tool that we use to teach our students the various techniques of aircraft accident investigation. We do training in the classroom, but the students also get to come out here to the lab, see broken aircraft parts and bits and pieces, and they get a chance to put things back together and try to piece together what caused a specific accident. When students come to the Aircraft Accident Investigation Laboratory, they get to practice accident site photography. They do GPS tagging to locate different bits of information. They measure distances so that they can draw wreckage diagrams. Sometimes we invite out the TV media class so the students will actually get a chance to conduct witness interviews and also conduct press briefings. Our witnesses reported hearing what sounded like a lawnmower bogging down in tall grass. And um, then they heard a thud. They got to the crash site and this is what they found. Um, the helicopter was kind of sitting like this, the skids were kind of bowed out. So now your job is to quickly, in about five minutes, using the evidence that we have here, try to explain why this helicopter crashed. So this is a really wonderful hands-on tool where students physically get to come outside in a nine-classroom environment and practice the various techniques of aircraft accident investigation. 